Henshaw's products. Welcome to Henshaw's Knowledge Village. Today I'm here to talk about some fantastic products from Optelec that will enable you to read. And I don't mean read in a conventional way using magnification like glass optics, which I've got a place and it's probably another video, but electronic magnification to help you read the stuff that comes through your letterbox or menus in a pub or timetables at the train station or bus station or even little labels in Marks and Spencers. If you're interested in any of that, watch on. We'll say hello to my little friend, the Optelec Compact 6HD. They've got various sizes, but this is the six inch, so a really portable solution. It's got two cameras. Camera one is for the mode, which is the usual mode really, the desktop mode. And it's got a holder there, so it actually sits nicely on the desktop, so we can slide, scan and slide, I like to say, the reading material that you're looking for. So you can do some distance work by taking it out of the holder, and then you can look at things like bus timetables, um, the pub blackboard with the lovely specials on it, things like that. It really covers two bases. So it's also got a feature called Miracast. Miracast is a feature that allows you to project the image from your desktop solution to a larger screen like your TV, as long as that TV is compatible. To be honest, most TVs, most modern smart TVs are compatible, so you shouldn't have a problem with that. I really like to mention the fact that this is HD quality and you can really tell the difference between you know, a, an inferior um, desktop magnifier and something like this. There's absolutely no snow on the screen to be seen. So we're gonna run through some of the features of this, kind of real life situations where this product, be it in your house or being it on the move, can help you in many ways. So let me take you through the features of the Optelec HD6. Essentially a solution for people that have difficulty reading. Those people that are partially sighted or blind. So I'm going to bring it onto this tabloid newspaper. The first thing you'll notice, it's on a stand. As I said before, the stand is getting it at a right angle. The other thing is it's got lights already. So it knows in this mode, which is basically kind of desktop mode. I want lights on and it automatically focuses. And essentially what you then do is slide it around the page to find the things you want to read or you think you want to read. Once you get there, you work out what magnification you need. Remember, it does change, right? Because it all depends on what type, size, font the thing is you're reading, all right? So some have smaller font and some have larger font. So usually you'll need to adjust it, but not every time, you know, so most letters that come through your door are usually the same size font. But anyway, so I've got my morning paper, I've got my reader, and it's on the font size that I want to read. I can manipulate that now. So essentially no buttons on it, it's all touch screen. And again, we can do the pinch gesture, or if we like, we can press the plus and the minus buttons that are high contrast and you can adjust that in any way you shape or form. At the moment we're in live mode, okay? So it shows you the picture as it is represented on the page. But then what we can do is go into contrast mode and I'll do that now. So that's white on black, okay? Um, that's kind of my favorite um, colour, uh, but some people like different types. So that's black on white, we've got 
Um, some people love that. That's yellow on black. And you can just keep changing it. We're back to the mode essential air, which I call live mode. Very intuitive, very easy to do. And you can just basically scan to whatever you think is appropriate for you. But this is fantastic for reading um, on the fly, on on the go as well. So as I mentioned previously, this has got two cameras. It's got a camera that's literally looking now in a desktop mode, but it's also got a camera to view in a different mode by taking out the cradle and using it to, to basically scan. And that's called the overview mode. So the overview mode is meant to be used with scanning and being taken out of the cradle. It comes out of the cradle really well. And essentially, eh? we mooch around to find the things we want to read. But there's Deb's doing her work, like she does. Um, but like I said, this, you could be at a train station, you could be in a pub, you could be at the GP, you could be at the hospital, it could be anywhere where doing that and basically kind of free reading is something that is more appropriate. So again, it's got two uses, desktop and out and about. Another feature that's worth noting is that you can save documents. So if you've got your favorite curry house and you want to recall the menu, you can do that too. So uh, all in all, fantastic product. Not just for text, it can be for anything. If you're a stamp collector, you can get right inside that detail or anything else you fancy, like, like watch faces. I like watches. Optelec have created an additional um, piece of kit, uh, which is basically headwear. So it allows you to use the HD6 hands-free. Um, and they use that by inserting the HD into this kind of visor. And then you put it on your head, essentially. Um, what basically allows you to do is go hands-free. So you could, you could use it for doing everyday tasks, you know, like reading and writing, or watching the TV, possibly even cooking. Um, what they do say is it's not for mobility. What it can do is limit your peripheral vision. What they thought about that, because they listen. So you can actually remove the side panels on each side of the device, so your peripheral vision isn't limited. So it doesn't give you that fully enclosed kind of feeling. So this might be a really good solution for you. The only way you'll know is to try it out. And again, if you've got any questions, queries, or concerns, just let us know. We'll help you any way we can. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna show you how this works and how we put it all together, but it's dead easy. Takes the HD out of its uh, stand, slot it in. I wear glasses, so I'm gonna have to take them off for the time being. Hands free. And if you like, you can just easily remove the side panels. So there you go. And there. So now I've got my peripheral vision back, but then I am, you know, the, the magnification is centered there. And the way you change it is by just bringing your finger into the screen, just as you normally would. So it's okay. As you'd expect from Optelec, pack full of features. Um, so it's got tactile buttons, contrasting buttons. Um, on the screen, you can actually adjust uh, the way the buttons work for you. It's got a great clock mode. Um, it's got continuous battery life of three hours, which isn't shy at all. So um, the best feature really is the desktop mode and the overview mode. That's really good for looking at objects, looking at pictures while you're out and about. Um, but obviously then doing uh, desk work uh, with the stand that it's got. So. Um, Top trumps again for Optelec. So I hope you like this video. Reading solutions from Optelec are the top of their game. Um, so if you've got any questions, queries, concerns, 
just let us know. So give us an email, buzz us, whatever you need to do. And as always, it's really important if you subscribe, comment, like, because it helps us get into the top ranking on YouTube. It really does help us a lot. Um, so I'm going to sign off. So cheers. Our videos are helping people across the world. If you found them useful, please donate on our website so we can keep making more videos like this in the future. Henshaws, supporting people with sight loss and a range of other disabilities to go beyond expectations.